Welcome to a PP video. If you guys like this PP, go ahead and hit that like and subscribe button. Enjoy. Welcome, ladies and gentlemen, back to another episode of High on Life. We are starting the television. You might hear my birds in the back, but we're going to continue. Hey, yeah. Uh, I actually wanted to run something by you. How would you feel about me maybe fixing up my old bounty hunting ads? Maybe putting you in them to drum up business? I All mean, right. my name will still be bigger than yours in the logo, but we'd be stupid not to capitalize on your growing reputation. Yo, you guys are fresh out of the Friendelos. fuck, bro? Who's this guy? Oh. Friendelos? Hey, I I'm Twig. I'm dating your sister. Uh, this fucking guy. This fucking Tweet, guy. You need to leave. Um, Lizzie says it's cool if I'm here. You're just gonna let this sack of shit eat all my friendalos and tongue kiss your sister? I'm the one who bought those fucking friendalos and leave Tweak alone. You know he has a barbed tongue and he's very sensitive about it. I can go. No, Tweak. You're staying. Tell him he's staying. Look, he doesn't even love you. He's he just doesn't our even house. love it's you. Our house. Exactly. Hey, Tweak. You Dude, is this your weed, bro? Lizzie. She's just gonna hit it and quit it. Real hard for <laughs> I'd get up now while you're still in the green. And hey, you want a real Tommy T Rex? Talk to me. Don't you have a galaxy to fuck? Come on, tell him to leave. Hey, Tweak, get the fuck out of oh, here. Come on, you shouldn't even get to decide. It's my house, too, you know? Fuck all of you. Aw. Not you, Tweak. I love you, baby. Ah! Disgusting! Look at this! They're not even the same species! Do, do you know how many holes he has? And they're all really what advanced the holes. Fuck? You really gotta take my nephew instead. His holes are more your speed. Shut the hell up, Gene. <laughs> I am sick of your shit. All you do is sit on our couch and mope about how sad your life is. You're a leech trying to eat all of our friend Correct. And use the only family I have left to relive your glory days. Hey! Your family's doing a great they job. They personally don't you need all this. To kill that many high-level bounties in such a short amount of time. I mean, they need shorter dialogue. I could have done it, but this uh, should be like side I mission dialogue, you know? Great job, and I'm proud of them. But this but should I'm not be main mission dialogue, honestly. All time, probably all, all of this pathetic. that we're listening to is probably going to get cut. Pathetic he is. Let's Can go back to the bounty commercials. Honey. Let's go. Come on, let's just go. At least we got one more sack of shard out of here. Too much dialogue in this bitch. Look, we're just trying to kill Mr. Dr. Giblets over here. All right, here's the skinny. You're all gonna need some major firepower if you really plan to take on Garmantuous. Our team already has this four is Garmantuous. guns. Isn't that enough? I'm asking for real. I really don't know. Trust me, we need this. Clug sent over the details on an extremely powerful Gatlian. Oh, another Gatlian. That's fantastic. Let's go. Let's That's go. Right. Supposedly he's in the possession of another G3 officer, a scientist named Dr. John Giblets. And guess what? I can't find shit on him. I don't even know where he is. Don't get mad at me for not knowing this, because remember, my brain's been scrambled. But how would we find him? <laughs> Do it the old-fashioned way and ask around. Maybe we find out his coordinates and warp him in. I'm sending you to Blim to gather intel. I don't know. I'm fucking tired, kid. Maybe you'll appreciate me more if you do my job. I haven't known you very long, Gene, but I respect you more than anyone else Let's I've go. ever met in my life. All right. <laughs> skip the portal door and just head out into Blim. Oh, and before you go, you might need a little extra help. I went ahead and unlocked a new feature on your bounty suit. You're Analyzing. welcome. All right. What's going on? Detective here, mode. It's me, Pseudo, again. I'm still here. I've been here the whole time. Welcome to detective mode. I'm here to help you sleuth out all those really big, crazy mysteries. Detective mode? Hey, what's so skinny on this giblets, fella? All right, let's see. It looks like you're looking for a... Dr. John Giblets. Is that correct? Very keen of you, Slim. See, Kernect. Oh, fantastic. Kernect. Let me do a quick search for you. This will solve it immediately, and... No matches found. Oh, well, it's never that easy. Why don't you start by interrogating the locals? And two and two makes four. Let's do what the suit says, kid. Two and two, tip and two curb, and I'm a douche. Hey, look at me. I'm the guy who sells stuff. I'm an illegal concessions guy. I'd like to sell you illegal stuff over here. Yeah, illegal let's see it. shit. This guy is talking my language. Here's what's up. My name's Stan, and I sell vials of alien cum. I know that's probably alien not what you cum? wanted to hear when you walked over here. You want it cum or what? 
Do I? I'll buy some cum. Fork over the gum, fucko. <laughs> <laughs> Didn't even ask any questions. <laughs> Didn't even ask how much it cost. I, <laughs> I knew I was right about you. I knew you loved alien cum. Well, here. Oh, I don't know. On the house. Just tell all your friends Gallons about of alien cum. Say Stan has the absolute best alien cum I've ever seen. Taste Let's it, touch it, whatever. I'm not sure if it's his or if he's getting it from some other alien. But I'm just such a huge fan of his work and what he's doing out there on the streets of Liam City selling yes, alien cum sir. to the community. Say all of that. Ah, looking for more alien cum, are you? Well, I'm sorry. I'm fresh out of alien cum right now. We sell out early sometimes. I gotta go restock my supply, and that's not so easy, trust me. But give me a little bit and I have plenty more. I promise. I just I just need some recovery time. That's hilarious. <laughs> Yo, Bounty Hunter, come see what I've got in stock on the food menu. Look, I said I don't know nothing about Dr. Giblet, so leave me alone. Unless you want to buy something, that's different. You can still buy stuff from me, that's totally fine. Ah, oh, that piece of shit, I'm gonna kill him. Look, if you're really looking for trouble, maybe check out the new High on Life store in the slums. The Hyperbong 6 Midnight launches tonight, but you should be able to get in by now. Just don't mention my name, I didn't say nothing. Now get out of here. If anyone sees me talking to you, I'm dead. Good looking out, Broto. You're good people, stay that way. Stay that way. Oh, great sleuthing detectives. That was an S rank interrogation. Turning a lot of eyes. A lot of people are really S rank, rank, rank. Hey, this is my favorite VIP. Hey, you don't have to wait through any of this funny business. You are allowed right in, yes, my friend. Yes, sir. Yeah, you better head straight through. I don't want jerks like you hanging around. I appreciate it. Up we go. Uh, not today, Taylor. So hard to see at night. What's up? What's up? What's up? supposed to jump right there oh what's up glad I'm not the one doing the running Almost there, we're getting there, we're getting there. Wow, looks like the property value's going up around here. High on life has gotta be close. Look at this. <laughs> Applebee's, let's go. Space Applebee's. This is sick. That's literally Applebee's. Space Applebee's. <laughs> That's awesome. They have a little song there too. The waiting room. Okay, let's move on. Get that loot. Get that loot, 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 loot. 
I need the new. Hey, don't worry, rod. detectives can always cut understand. lines. The rules this do not apply like to the a law. This is consumer loyalty thing. It's more like uh, I'm addicted to drugs. Um, who do I talk oh, thank to God here? God, they opened this new high on Life Store. Welcome to High on Life Store number 7923, your local Hyperbong Superstore. Please, no trampling of other patrons during the midnight launch. All right. Well, well, well. I smell another mystery. I'm Pseudo, by the way. You know me. Uh, yeah, we're, we're still tracking down giblets. So yeah, these are Hyperbongs. Oh, my God. Here. Yeah, no shit. That's what, that's what the fuck we're going to do. That's hilarious. It is my pleasure to welcome you to High on Life. Are you being helped already? Um, what's a hyperbong? Oh, I'm so excited you asked. A hyperbong is a device used to absorb the life energy of another species in order to trigger a psychedelic effect in the operator. Oh, that sounds awesome. I'm so sorry. That is a really fantastic question, but I'm not authorized to answer it. All right. Have you considered buying a drop fruit case for your hyperbong? Um, did you approve this? You know, I can't recall whether or not I've heard that name before, but I'm actually much more interested in telling you all about the fabulous features that come packed in with the brand new Hyperbong 6. Oh, this guy doesn't know. Hi, on Life employees politely request that you don't alert the other customers to the fact that we are part owned by the Torg family. That worries the other customers, and we don't want that. Ooh, boy, they really want to make that commission, huh? Sorry, but I gotta give you another <laughs> D rank. No, not a D rank. They D ranked uh, my uh, ass. Uh, uh, hello, hello, and welcome, welcome to High on Life. I'm Barrick, and I can be a personal uh, High on Life uh, prof professional today. Um, do, that makes sense, right? That, does that sound okay? I'm, I'm new here. Me? Oh, no, 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 I'm, uh, I'm straight edge. I don't even like thinking about drugs. This job was a, oh, it was a bad idea for me, probably. Um, do you know who Dr. Hey, Giblet hey, is? Hey, it's my first day. Uh, can you do me a favor and not mention Dr. Giblets around here? They told us not to talk about him. God, I'd really love to help you because you look very cool. But no, sorry, I, I, I have no clue. Oh, no, it's okay, I guess. Uh, it's the big Hyperbond 6 Midnight Launch, and we literally just opened, so uh, i only been here for, like, half an hour. And honestly, okay, yeah, it kind of sucks so far because, like, I can already feel my soul leaving my body. Oh, I love that. Wow, nice kid, but not helpful at all. You get a big, fat D-ranking. What the D-ranks? Where's the other guy at? You actually have to go through all of them. Holy shit, this is a madhouse. Oh, 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 sorry. Hi, thanks for shopping at High on Life. I'm the manager here. Are, are you finding everything okay? Oh, okay. Um, so you're the manager here. That's right, it's a big day. I didn't think there'd be this many people lining up to buy hyper bongs. Probably a bad sign for our city. Do you like hyper bongs? Huh? Nah. I think they're probably bad for society overall, you know? I mean, uh, I don't have a problem with drugs in general, but hyperbongs are like, the drugs are living creatures and they die, and that seems a little fucked up, right? But hey, I'm the manager at the store that sells hyperbongs. I probably shouldn't be saying stuff like that. It's hypocritical, it's weird. I don't know, I'm just here. I'm just here. Oh man, this again. Look, man, I just work here. I don't know anything about the store or who built it. Or I'm, I'm kind of a fuck up. I lied on my resume. I got this manager gig. I never even met Dr. Giblets. I, I don't know what he looks like. I couldn't even point him out in a crowd. But, but right. you know about him. Yeah, yeah, sure I do. He owns this place. He never comes around, though. I don't really know where he is. Tell us where Dr. What? Giblet is. I told you. I have no idea where he is. And you're being really aggressive. Leave me alone. It's super fucking busy right now, and you're distracting the hell out of me. Okay, shit, not, not so good. It looks like we've uh, hit, a, hit a dead end, so let's get the fuck out of here and just give up on being detectives. It's all done now. <laughs> I like that, I like that, I like that. Hello, and welcome to High on Life. How can High on Life help you today? Um...
All right, I think we're good. Nice day for a shopping trip, ain't it? It sure is. I know I'd go shopping on a day like this. Except this wannabe bounty hunter doesn't seem to be shopping. That's right. Seems like they're poking their beak where it don't belong. Be a shame if something happened to your beak as a result if you catch our drift. More of this shit? Are you fucking kidding me? More? More of this? Why is everybody on our case today? Please, just fuck off! You got a fresh mouth on you, kid. Be a shame if something happened to that mouth as a result. Part of oh, my no. associate here, he's only got one good threat, but I assure you, he can back it up. That's right. A word to the wise. Stay out of this. Got it? We've got this covered. What the hell was that? We've got... Yo, get out of the way, Scroobles. Oh, touch my ghetto, Personal space. Please touch me, touch me, touch me, touch me. I need it. Holy shit, what, what the fuck? Was this guy trampled to death? Uh, yeah. My friend Davy Glutes got trampled in the rush. Pretty what? sad, right? Oh, you can go ahead and take his mag boots. It's not a problem. He was really... Mag boots. A lot of people think mag boots is short for magnetic boots because they have magnetic on their soles and you can use them to walk on magnetic surfaces. Well, those people are right. That's exactly what it stands for. No twist here. Congratulations to those smart people who knew ex what it was. What it was. What it was. <laughs> there <you go. laughs> yeah, that's fine. Time oh, my goodness. Okay, look, I know this is a little fucked, but these boots are going to be very useful. And, and they're the, the only fuck? way out of here. Well, you know, hey, six moves. You're making good use of those mag boots. You're using those things way better than David Luke ever did. Look at you! Now, this is a weird mechanic for sure. Hey there, is it going to be fun? Fun, I feel so good. Sniper detected. My trick hole is feeling refreshed. Section mod. This Augman gives Gus an alternate method of sucking up enemies. Charge up, release, pull everything towards you in one burr. burr. Oh, what a fucking rip off! I'm down. Let's use that. How do we activate it? Is it already in our inventory? Oh, you have to activate it. See? Equip mod. And this one too, with the augment, we'll return to you with the gift and extra, yep. Okay, we made it back. That was, we basically explored, upgraded Welcome a little back. bit. We've got company. Oh Hello God. There. You two again? Don't worry, they're cool. We've been observing you. Hope that don't rustle your jimmies none. Because newsflash buckos, we're on your side. We'd like to formally apologize for how we treated you earlier. We didn't realize who we Hell were dealing yeah. with. You'll have to forgive us. And we're sorry we still sound like we're intimidating you. It's the only way we know how to talk. Our wives hate us. So, who sent you here then? We represent Magistrate Clug Nugman. Maybe you've heard of him. He's certainly heard of you. Here's the skinny slim. The Torg family, or what's left of it anyway. They got mixed up with a bad crowd. The G3 cartel. Or more specifically, 
Dr. John Giblets, Ph.D. Dr. John Giblets. He says you're the right bounty hunter for the job. Says you're already helping him. Says the G3 is our common enemy. We've got a lead on Dr. Giblets. He's been warping all over, leaving behind a nice little warp trail for us. We're thinking you can follow those breadcrumbs all the way to the gingerbread house. All that the way, Clark, don't have to get his two little heads dirty. Ginger. You dig? You dig? You already planned to kill him. You want us to kill him. This kid's fast. Yeah, check out Dale Earnhardt Jr. over here. Let's say somebody dies. Maybe, hypothetically, their name is Dr. Giblets. Well, should anything like that happen, we had nothing to do with it. We didn't even mention it. This conversation never happened. And Clug will be very grateful. Speaking of which, why don't you follow us? Clug wants to speak in person. Let's go, Cluggy. How about that? How about let's talk to Clug? Oh, welcome back. Thank you so God, much. Last time I was here, he was talking yeah, for at least 15 yeah, minutes. I had to cut it all out of the What's video. Cracking? Sorry about those two. They can be a bit intense. Really, I don't know why they talk like that. So but look, plug. you've seriously done so much for me. I hate to ask for anything else, but this election is really close. And, well, keeping the G3 out of Blim, it's really going to help me lock this in. Do you think you could, you know, deal with Dr. Giblets? Absolutely. But we hit a dead end. A dead end? Oh no, we can't have that. Let me just leave this map data right here on my desk. Not sure what might be on it. Giblets! Oh, I, yeah, I, I see what's happening here. You're pointing us to Dr. Giblets. Whoa, whoa, even if this map data <laughs> did take you to Dr. Giblets, we're not 100% sure it would be his actual base. You'll still need to do some detective work. Fuck yeah. Right, so we can. Hey, 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 Fuck yeah. I can't officially tell you to do that. Not if I want to win this next election, at least. <laughs> Good luck out there, bounty hunter. We got All right. this. Oh, nice, nice, nice. Now we can find Giblets. Make like a tree. Thanks for Get helping out. our dad. We love our dad, Clug. They're my kids, yeah. Forgot to mention that. <laughs> Good boys, too. You're doing great work. Thank you, thank you. All right. We're, we're looking... We're See, looking dandy. Clug saved our ass. He showed us where Giblets is. It's great. I realized our character changed when we equipped a, a new ability on him. What does creature look like then? And we kill giblets. Well, use the portal to tap. You're gonna have to catch me. Um. I'm so lost. What did he say? On Zeppelin. Which one's Zeppelin? This one? Hopefully we chose the right one. I chose the one that had the little blue marker, so I'm, I'm, I'm assuming that's the right one. Look at those dodging. Alright, so this is supposed to give me health back now. My goodness. I was just I'm just trolling. I'm literally trolling. Let's shut that out for good. That's so awesome. Yo, headshot him. Dream team back in action. Wait, let's get 
Alex, you're totally bounty hunter, please. Developed in a sort of weird way over here. Welcome to Highway Village. Our currency here is tires, and we sacrifice our younglings to the Lord Asphaltia, High God of the Way. What the fuck is happening here, guys? Hey, I'm the youngest one left alive. That means they're gonna sacrifice me to Lord Asphaltia tomorrow. I'm not too excited about <laughs> it, to be honest, actually. Oh, goodness. Hello, friend. My old life was flawed. Now you're blessed by Lord Asphaltia. God bless Lord Asphaltia. Help! Help! I, I, I'm dying! I'm dying! Uh, oh, thank God. Thank God someone's here. Oh my goodness! I, I'm, I'm, I'm losing consciousness. Oh. Oh. Holy shit, dude. You're fucked. What happened? A G3 base warped right through here. Right, 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 right where I was. And, uh, well, well it shot me uh, right in half. I got cut in half. Bet it was Dr. Giblet's base. Oh, God. Oh, God, I'm fading fast. Please, please, please just stay with me while I die. I, I, I don't want to be alone. I don't want to be alone. No, come on. You're not dead yet. We're still here with you. You'll be fine. No, no. It, it's my time to go. Oh, thank you. For, for staying with me <laughs> as I die. Oh, just, just don't leave. Okay. And I feel it. Here I go. Oh, I'm, I'm dead. I'm dead. Oh. Yep, that's just how it is in this sick fuck of the universe. Hey, 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 where, where are you guys going? You you promised me to stay with me. Hey, hey, thanks for coming back. You're not really dying, are you? <laughs> no, no, no. Oh, oh, I'm dying. No, I'm actually, oh, not uh, for real this time, though. Oh, my God. Oh, stay. Don't go anywhere. Stay with me. Thank you. Oh, here, here I go. Oh, my God. Oh. All right, enough of this guy. Let's bounce. You think he's dead? Hey, hey, what the fuck? You left me again. I'm, I'm not dead. Rest in peace, fucko. Put him out of his misery, guys. How to do what I had to do for the bungalow. What is this? Hey. Oh, dude, nice. Feel that? That's the energy of this place. Give Dura tank, we need this. How do we use them? Are they already in there? Okay. You made the right call. Um. Oh yeah. I'm just out here. That's fate right there. Life gives you all the tools you need. I like that one too. You That's a good one. To learn how to use them. Hello again. Okay, giblets, you sick fuck. Come on out. Where are you? Oh, I'm sure we'll be able to find Dr. Giblets with just a little bit of detective work. Let's look around for clues. Fine, let's just get this shit over with. Hold the a lot of dead bodies. What do you think happened in here? Someone was killing G3 Mercs. 
You know what? That makes sense. Everyone hates the G3. I bet people try to kill them all the time. I mean, look at you. That's what you're doing. That's exactly what I'm doing. Let's see what this hap what happened with this fella here. This fella you right here. The big picture. I mean, you get it. What the hell? All right. Just a bunch of dead corpses. Oh, uh, is that what's happening? I don't understand what's happening. Hey, what are you doing? You should go back and investigate more. I hope Pseudo gets a virus and dies. But he's right. We gotta poke around to find Dr. Giblets. I'm trying. Oh, right here? Ooh, a destroyed drone. Looks like it was deployed for combat. Nothing fishy there. That's what they're used for. That's what drones are for. They're for combat. That's not weird to see a destroyed drone. Um. All right, sick. We're back. We're gonna keep investigating now. Let's find Doctor Giblets. Scanning, 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 Looks scanning. Looks like your typical work desk. Nothing too crazy. Uh, uh, you know, best I can guess is. Someone interrupted Dr. Giblets while he was doing experiments. I don't know. I'm just throwing stuff at the wall here. So that's it. Okay, yeah, I think I'm getting a sense of what happened here. Someone beat us to the punch. They attacked Dr. Giblets and all his men. Oh, we need more information. Let me hack the door so we can go deeper and look for more clues. All right, hack the door, you hack the door. better be there. Howdy there, cowboys! Uh, oh shit, sorry, wrong bit, wrong bit. I mean, howdy there, detectives! Ooh, this looks like the lab where Dr. Giblets did his experiments. There's gotta be something helpful in here. Let's get to scanning! Let's get to scanning! Oh, there's scanning. Be all the hyperbone prototypes. Way jankier than the ones they're selling at the High on Life store. Well, you know, we just pointed these out. Now we can move on to the next thing. Scanning dead body. Was he doing experiments on his own henchmen? Jesus Christ, that's fucked up, right? Yeah, that's fucked up. I know it's fucked up. I don't know why I asked. I knew it was fucked up. Dr. Giblets must have been losing his mind. Dude, this is so Queer, messed up. Look at all these drone heads. Dr. Giblets was an expert at creating cybernetic organisms. But we already knew that. No, I don't think this is a very helpful clue. I do think it's neat, though. It's cool to look at fucked up drone heads. Thanks for <laughs> showing me this. Hack the door now. All right, here's my new theory. Dr. Giblets was even more twisted than we could ever imagine. He was torturing his own henchmen. He wasn't right in the head. Uh -huh. I guess that's what Douglas did too, so maybe that's normal for the G3. Maybe he was normal. No way to know unless we go deeper. I'm hacking the next door. Yup, yup, yup. All right, I got no fucking idea what this room is, but I'm sure there's more clues in here, so go, go find more clues, baby. Go find more clues, baby! Oh boy, did Dr. Giblets write this? He was really paranoid, huh? He, was he really me. thought people were trying to kill him. And you know what? Uh, he, he was right, because that's exactly what we're here to do. So, okay, he was right. Not crazy. Normal guy. Are these second place trophies? They're trophies for, for what? Science? Just science in general? Do they really give out second place trophies for science? Jeez, it looks like Dr. Giblets was pissed you didn't get first place in, in science. First place in science? A Gatlian's in there. Oh no, they look Busted. like shit. Aha, so that's our murder weapon. Dr. Giblets must have used that modified Gatlian to attack his men. It's pretty powerful, did a lot of did a lot of damage. It'd be great if we could somehow get that Gatlian for ourselves. You think that's gonna happen? Uh, who knows, let's find out. It's probably not gonna happen, to be honest. Okay, I think we finally cracked this case. Dr. Giblets really did go insane. He was paranoid that someone was after him, so he killed his own men. While you were wasting time doing detective work, I was busy scanning the area for Dr. Giblets and decrypting the password on his security systems. Now you can just follow the waypoint right to him. So you wasted our fucking time, Pseudo! Yep, sorry. I just love detective mode so much, I didn't want you to stop using it. This now go kill Dr. Giblets. This guy, bruh. Fell. Sometimes I don't even know what I'm doing. Oh, this is him. 
Jonathan Giblets. Well, okay. Uh, I guess Dr. Giblets went and killed himself for us. That was anticlimactic. Jesus Christ, that was <laughs> the easiest one yet. All right, let me at him. Really? You're joking. What the fuck are you waiting for? The guy died. So let me carve him up already. I'm high on life. What? Dr. Giblet's status report. No life sense detected. Entering full security lockdown. Shit. Hello. If you're hearing this pre-recorded message, it means you've successfully managed to murder one of the greatest minds in all of super science. Congratulations. You killed me. But I knew this day would come, and I was prepared for this <laughs> Okay, okay, moment. this is sick. Now, see, if you can survive my retribution from beyond the grave. Okay, shit, yes. We do get to fight. Are you kidding me? They know exactly. Me crazy. But look at me now. I'm dead, and you're trapped in here. Falling prey to my glorious science you were ever so jealous of. Oh yeah, get that throw. Actually, I want him. There we go. Go kill. I don't really have anything to say about it. I just wanted to cover all my bases here. Good work using the But you will lose the war. No, dude, these guys are easy squeezy, lemon squeezy, the demon squeezy. You gotta prep this one. Let's go. Let's go. Easy squeezy, lemon squeezy, bro. So many little critters. What the hell? This guy is just savage. This guy is just straight up savage. Minions are nothing to me. Freaking little 
my custom a shield. This guy got glitched. Yo, I almost died. I knew you'd be tough. It's one thing to serve in the G3, but it's another altogether to fold it in the body of the time of the I really didn't expect you to be Oh, God, dude. Am I really gonna die like that? Oh, my God. That was messed up. That was a troll. Kill you back. I don't know where this guy is. I'm throwing everything I have at you, but can you survive this entire base self-destructor? Okay, I'll have to remember to rig that up later in the time of this video. Note to self, rig up base to self-destruct. Rig up base to self-destruct. Rig up base, okay. I love this gameplay, man. It's just 
so interactive. Super interactive. It's it's lovely. They really hit the mark with this game. I love it. Don't let that happen. Don't let it happen. I thought I was okay on that wall. Oh no, we glitched the game. We glitched the game. Go. Die, boy. Die, boy. Okay, this is my final message. If you're still alive to hear this, then I've made a great mistake. I was wrong. Only one person could have survived all of that. Myself. I killed myself. There we go. The dumbass finally got it. <laughs> Since you know, I hated myself. I knew I'd get the guts to do it one of these days. Good for me. Yeesh, way to kill the mood. So, okay, I killed myself. Whoops. My apologies to whoever's hearing this. I hope you'll forgive me for making you go through all of that. You can leave now. Have a good day. Jim is out. Jesus, dude, Jimmy. I died so many well, times. Well, that was fun. We can get back out through the trap door. Let's scram. As I continue to study these humans, I find them to be more complex than I ever could have expected. Initially, I saw great potential in both the Fergals and the Gatlians, but now, I see how foolish I was. Those were nothing but dead ends. Humans, however, humans are going to change everything. Figures the G3 would work with a creepy fuck like this. A creepy fool, eh? What the hell did some famous scientist dork want with Gatlians? Oh, fuck. That's Let's Do It over there. He was pretty famous on Gatlas. Fuck, oh, that's bad. Look at him just hanging there. I hate to say it, but he might be a goner. Let's take him to Gene and see if he can help. Yeah, he might be dead. Busted Gatlian. Now we're. I just wanted to say, you know, 
today really meant a lot to me and um uh this fucking God, guy is so fucking hard um your free trial of detective mode is up so see you later bye Aww. Hey, he can't see you. that's hilarious Look at that. You found Dr. Giblets all by yourself. See? It's not so easy figuring out where these bozos are. How'd it go? Come on over, let's powwow! What's a powwow? Okay, uh, so we did find Dr. Giblets. Um, he is dead, but we also found another Gatlian. Oh shit! That's great. I I I I don't know about that. I mean, he he's, he's not really functional. I don't I don't I don't I don't think he's dead. But oh, god damn. Yeah, he's busted up real bad. What were they doing to him? Do they you, just do throw him on the he's table. Salvageable, buddy. I'm not gonna promise you I can save him. That would be irresponsible of me. It would be careless to toy with your emotions like that. But yes, I can definitely fix it. Okay. Th thanks, Gene. Well, you know, if, if you can't be saved, it, it wouldn't be, uh... What was that? Uh, nothing! I, 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 it's I was not gonna being get shitty. saved. You, you, you didn't hear me. You, I don't want you to hear me being shitty. Yeah, okay. Weird thing to say, but whatever. Sorry to change the subject, but, uh... Turn in your bounty real quick. I've got some good news and some bad news. That's it. That's all we're gonna do. That was another episode. Get your shit settled before we talk. Shut up. I'm doing an outro. That was it, though. Hope y'all enjoyed it. I had a fantastic time. We're doing another episode here shortly. This will probably be the end of High on Life this week. We're focusing more on TRTL Gaming next week, Call of Duty next week. It's going to be fantastic. I hope you enjoyed this series so far. We'll be back on it shortly. Soon. I mean, I might double upload. We'll see. Depends on how, how everything turns out next week. Alright? Alright. Well, catch you on the next one. Blessings. Every day is a blessing. It's a blessing.